Christopher Bell, who restarted 12th, or 12th right now, restarted second. And seven to go in the stage, everybody fighting for stage points. Yeah, and that's what you saw in that in-car camera with uh, Kyle Busch and, and Denny Hamlin. He, he doesn't want to give up that point. Derek Krause just ahead of our race leader. Talked about that bucking horse on the hood of Krause's car. That, I learned on social media last night, is Steamboat. Uh, a very famous bucking horse and pretty much the... Uh, state emblem of Wyoming for sure you roll into Wyoming you're going to see that logo that image all over the place cool state not near as good as Kansas though. I mean, we're right. in Kansas we are in Kansas out. yeah Dorothy did you know that Toto was not the original choice of name for that dog in the Wizard of Oz That's or was he supposed to be a terrier huh. I learned this from our catering guys Is his name supposed to be Clint no Otto and Otto. he was supposed to be a dachshund but uh, World War II was brewing and sentiment there, worries about Germany. They made him a terrier and called him Toto. And the rest is history. Learn something every week, Clint. Well, useless information. All right, five to go. Christopher Bell trying to fight back here. He was second at the restart, currently in 12th, battling Chase Elliott. Here we go, yes, Denny no. Hamlin. Yeah, Again, got it. On the inside of, of Kyle Busch there, and he makes it happen this time. This has been a fit over here. Chastain, boy, they all say he's hard to pass. Reddick is living it right now, boy. Yeah, Reddick was already by him one time and uh, had to check up right there, and Ross got back by, and now it, it seems like Tyler Reddick uh, just can't get, get back around Ross. And that's what, what we talk about, you know, the, the tire advantage and when does it shut off? It obviously seems like it's become much more difficult these last couple laps for, for Reddick to make up the ground than it was even five, six, seven laps ago. So these tires, they get to a point, they're done, the car starts to slide around, right rear starts to slide, right front, whatever end you're struggling with, uh, they, just, they just finally stop doing what they're supposed to do. This guy right here, he hasn't, he hasn't stopped doing what he's supposed to do. Chris Buescher took control of this race, made a gutsy move on the, on the restart when Ross Chastain and, and Christopher Bell got tangled up there. Denny Hamlin is flying. That third place car, you're going to see him back, still digging out of this hole, but your leader, Buescher, 32-38. Larson, 32-51 behind him. Denny Hamlin, 32-08, flying out there. Well, the hard part for these teams is, you know, we, we had the conditions, the race starting later, and now it's going to start getting dark. It's going to start getting darker, cooler. You can see the light starting to show up on the, on the screen. So uh, Chris Buescher has done a great job in this stage. Last lap, coming down the back straightaway. Best news for Hamlin is he will not have to worry about Austin Hill in the pit stall in front of him. Hill is now one lap down. Hey, for the last st stage point, here comes Chase Elliott and Christopher Bell trying to get into that battle as Chris Buescher crosses the line with the stage win. Let's see who gets the last stage point right here. Be one of these two. It's going to be a drag race. I think it goes to Gregson. Gregson. 